desert hillside, Yerimanga opal fields, or the historic old mine site, and this is what the terrain around here looks like. Some old opal workings, old mines in the foreground. Little mesas, and just here we've come across an outcrop of boulder. That is a collector's piece, isn't it? It's amazing, isn't it? It is. I'd love to get it out of the ground. Do you reckon I could dig that up out of the ground by the sun? No. <laughs> Come across some old shafts while we're walking around in the bush. Looking, one there, another one over here. Here's another old shaft that uh, we came by on the top of this hill. Just imagine the effort it would have taken to do this by hand. They obviously didn't get through the hard layer on top but just extraordinary what the old timers did 150 years ago by hand we're in the Canaway Ranges the Aramanga Opal Fields we're at an abandoned mine site the actual miner that worked this place unfortunately died recently but this is how he lived this is his camp. It was his kitchen, dining, his bed. And his bottle collection. Heavy drinker by the looks of it. May have contributed to his demise. A lot of rum bottles in there and beer bottles. Here's just some of the things that we picked up while we're wandering around the field. Relics of old timers, miners that were here in the late 1800s, early 1900s. Camp ovens, bottles, lots of horseshoes, bits of opal, matchboxes. Here we are drilling at an old opal mine called the Scotch Lass on the Aramanga Opal Field. We're just in front of the old workings, which stretch all the way back here. Just the cuttings that are coming up. Setting up the tripod in preparation for Logging the hole. This is the probe that will show us the geology of the hole and the possible presence of any opal. It's officially known as a gamma ray logging tool. This computer is monitoring the probe. So this is a cutting that we recovered in one of our drill holes. Absolutely superb bit of crystal opal. And this is the gamma ray log that refers to that. And Brian will explain what it means. There's a, a strong peak at the contact between sandstone and the underlying clay stone which is mildly radioactive due to the presence of precious opal. This is another technique that we use in exploring for opal. It is a ground penetrating radar. So, I'm in the Canaway Ranges, the Aramanga Opal Field, at a disused, abandoned mine site. 
and we're just going through some of the boulders that the old miners left behind just cracking them open and this is what just came up out of one of the pieces of there cracked open red bar in the back green bar on the top beautiful stuff This is the Kyabra water hole, an amazing expanse of water in such a dry and arid environment, quite close to the opal field, great fishing, amazing spot. Thanks for watching.